Monday Night Football, week four. Here we go. We're talking the Las Vegas Raiders are at the Chargers. Use the promo code WNBA to save yourself 20% off the entire site. My name's Allie Burns from Picks and Parlays, and I've got your free NFL pick coming right up. Chip Chirimbus, our expert handicapper over at picksandparlays.net, is here to give us the play. What's going on, Chip? Well, we've had another fabulous Sunday in the NFL, went four and one with our Fab Five and hit our fifth straight NFL best bet winner. Our eight play Megabucks is five and oh on the season. And we have more in store this week. I'm telling you, I love the card this Sunday. I'm like on and off about this card. I think I love something and then I like talk myself out of it. So I need some expert advice, Chip. <laughs> Help me out on this Monday night game. Raiders at the Chargers. Chargers minus three. The total's 51 and a half. What are we going to do with this one? Well, I actually like what we have here in this game. Of course, Vegas is 3-0, and and the Chargers are 2-1 and on the year. But, you know, the Chargers have gone under all three games, and that's kind of surprising considering Herbert's the quarterback. And, the, of course, the Raiders have gone 2-1 and to the over, and the Raiders are averaging 471 yards a game, led by Derek Carr, of course. And the offense for the Chargers, just under 400 yards a game, 395 per game. But I have some stats about these two in matchups. Um, Vegas is 9-2-1 and one when playing on artificial surface in their last, what's that, 12 games. And they're 7-2-1 and one to the over when they're playing teams with winning records. They're last in red zone defense. The thing is, this year they've been good enough to keep teams out of the red zone. And their over is 6-2 and two on the road in their last eight games. Now, for the Chargers, they're 5-1 and one to the over against teams with winning records. This, of course, is 3-0, and oh, and 7-3 and three to the over against the AFC. There w- is one anomaly here. One thing that can stub the toe is that the meetings between these two teams in the last 21 games that the Chargers have hosted, and I say have hosted because they played in a number of different venues, have gone 16-4-1 and one to the under. But you know what? I think we can discard that because – this is a whole new regime here. Um, they're playing in SoFi, which is a very quick surface, and there should be a lot of a lot of points scored here, I think. And, you know, Derek Carr is having his best season ever. He's getting a little bit of protection. And I think finally the Chargers may be able to put some points on the board and go over the total. So I'm looking this total to go over, and I think that the Chargers and Raiders are going to be a great exhibition of fireworks on Monday night. All right. Well, I like your look on this. Um, do you have a premium play on this Monday night football game over at picksandparlays.net on who maybe you think which side will win? Um, not as of yet, but I will be posting the side, of course. Um, on Sunday, I have another big winner, another easy winner like the Dolphins last week. And of course, we are 5-0 in the NFL. Log on and follow the by links to get my Fab Five. That's my top five selections, four and one last week. And we had four straight winning weeks if you include the preseason. Beautiful. I love it. Thanks so much, Chip Chirimbus. Don't forget to check him out over at picksandparlays.net. Until then, we're rolling with the over 51 and a half in the Vegas Raiders and the LA Chargers.